Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. One, two, one, two, three. Good morning. Good morning. Hello and how are you? Early in the morning, I say good morning. Hello and how are you? Good morning. Good morning. Hello and how are you? Early in the morning, I say good morning. Hello and how are you? Good morning, boys and girls. It's me, Miss Celine. Welcome to room 105. It is our greeting time. My name is Miss Celine, and we have Miss Tayana as well. And we have our lovely seven friends in room 105. The first one is Secret Seal. Amina Iguana. Loyalty Lollipop. Braylon Broccoli. Marco Smitten. Chase Chair. And Sarai Sun. Those are all of our wonderful seven friends in our class. Now, boys and girls, we're no longer in May. Remember yesterday, I told you guys we were in a new month. The new month is June. June. Junio in Spanish. Junio. Today is Thursday, jueves, which means that yesterday was Wednesday, miércoles. That also means that tomorrow it's going to be Friday, viernes, viernes. The weather is. Have you guys looked outside today, boys and girls? Do you guys think it's super sunny? Or do you guys think it's raining? Hmm. I think it's sunny. It's sunny and hot. So I do hope you guys get some outdoor time today. All right, boys and girls. The color of the week, remember, it's black. Black. And in Spanish, it's negro, negro. The letter of the week is E, capital E and lowercase e, big E, small e. And our friend elephant right below starts with an E, e elephant. Elephant. E, our letter of the week. All right, now it's time to count our numbers. We're going to count them in, yes, English and then in Spanish. So repeat after me, okay? One, uno, two, dos. Three, tres, four, cuatro, five, cinco, six, seis, seven, siete, eight, ocho, nine, nueve, ten, Yes, ten like our ten fingers on our two hands. All right, boys and girls. Now we are going to talk about our feelings. Remember what I always say? 
that it's okay to feel all of these feelings. You can feel one at a time, you can feel two at a time, you can feel all of these at the same time. And it's okay. Let's go over our feelings. This is happy. And I'm so happy to be with you guys today. This is sad. Mm, I'm sad when I have to leave you guys or when I don't see you guys. This is scared. Like, oh no. You can be scared in many situations. And it's okay, remember. This is silly. Like when you're goofy and you just feel plain old silly. This is angry, mad, frustrated. It's okay to feel mad, angry. It's okay. But remember, when you're angry, sometimes you do or say things that you don't mean. But it's okay. Because when you're angry, we're going to try to calm down. Calm down like our breathing bunny. Remember? Breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. So, in through your nose and out through your mouth. Just like that. A few times so you can feel calm. And we can get to happy. But sometimes... You won't get happy fast, and that's still okay. Remember, all of these feelings are just okay. All right, boys and girls. Now we have a simple small group activity today. And our activity now that you guys know what my favorite color is, I'm going to use purple Play-Doh. And with an adult help, we're going to create our names just like this with the Play-Doh. And um, parents, if you don't um, have Play-Doh at home, I will link uh, today a video of Play-Doh that you can make at home, just so you don't have to buy anything. There's um, ingredients that you have already at home. So we can practice our names with the Play-Doh. Um, this is an activity super helpful for fine motor skills. Just like that. It's easy and fun with help. So I'll Link the ingredients to make your own Play-Doh if you don't have these. And that's it for today, boys and girls. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you next week. Bye.